Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to convert text to audio directly in Canva. This is a great feature if you're creating videos or presentations and want to add some voiceovers without recording your own voice. First, let's start by opening Canva. Once you're in, go ahead and open your design. For this tutorial, I've selected a ready-made video template that includes quiz questions as an example. Now, to add audio, click on the Apps section on the left-hand side. Scroll down until you reach the AI app section. Here, you'll want to select the app called AI Vuv. This app allows us to convert text into high-quality audio directly within Canva. To use AI Vuv, you'll need to sign up on their website. I'll leave you with some quick video clips showing the sign-up process, it's pretty straightforward. Once you're signed in, you're all set to start generating audio. Next, copy the text you want to convert and paste it into the input box within the AI Viv app. Once your text is in place, click on the Generate Audio button. As you can see, the audio file is now created and appears on the timeline below. What is the most common surname in the United States? You can drag the audio file to the appropriate place in your timeline, matching it perfectly with your scenes. Continue adding the rest of your text, generating audio, and placing it in your video. Another great feature is the ability to choose the type of voice you want from the drop-down list. Whether you prefer a male, female, or even a child's voice, you can select the one that best fits your project. You can also preview the voice by clicking on Preview Voice. If it sounds good, you can proceed with converting your text and using it in your design. One thing to keep in mind is that AIVOV offers limited credits for free users. Once you've used up your credits, you'll need to subscribe to their paid plan to continue using the app. And that's it. You've now learned how to easily convert text to audio in Canva using the AI Viv app. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more Canva tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.